In this video, we'll be looking at how to migrate your Ban the Box to a different computer. By default, Ban the Box can be installed on up to three personal computers at once, but there may be an instance where you want to remove a copy from your current system and migrate it to another one. If you would like, you can deactivate your program within Ban the Box. You're going to want to go to Help, Utilities, Special Options for Activation, Deactivation, and we're going to click Yes on this, and then you can select Release. This will release your application from the computer, and then that will allow you to activate it on a new computer. Please note, you may also need to do this if you are reinstalling your operating system. Now that the program has been deactivated, you will want to uninstall it. First, you're going to want to make sure that all of your personal files have been backed up. And once they are, simply delete the BB folder. You'll also want to do this with your real band folder if it is also in C. Once it's done, you're ready to install the program. How you migrate it to your computer? Generally, you would install it the same way as you did on your original system, via flash drive, DVD, or external hard drive. If you're running the Ultra Pack or the audio file, all you need to do is simply plug in your hard drive and select Setup. This will run you through the process to get it set up on your computer. If you're in a situation where you have lost your physical media or you've done this as a download, you'll be able to retrieve your program from our website www.pgmusic.com. What you'll want to do is log into your account on our website, and once you have, you'll be brought to the My Account page. From here, you're going to want to select My Products, and you'll scroll down until you see the available downloads. As you can see, we have Ban the Box Mega Pack upgrade with Real Ban for 2018. For Windows versions, you only need to install the program and the high Q instruments. You do this by selecting Download, and this will bring the download into your browser. Depending on the browser you're using, this may place it in different locations, but typically you'll be able to find it by going up to your settings on the top right and going to Downloads. As you can see, it'll take a little bit, a little bit longer to finish downloading. Once it is fully completed, you can run that. Once we have installed both Band the Box Real Band and HiQ Instruments for Ferzondo, we can do the rest in the program. You can do so by going to Help, Utilities, Run Download slash Install Manager Now. Doing so will ask where you want to put your downloads, and we're just going to hit OK here. This will bring up the PG Music Download Manager, and it'll begin building a list of packages. Please note that your product will have to be both registered online on our website and fully activated for the Download Manager to work. And what package size, do you remember what package size you had previously for your... Depending on the size of your package, building a list of packages can take anywhere from 10 seconds to a minute. In the Download Manager, you can also keep track of how much of your program is installed. So you can generally find this on the bottom where you see Total Progress. You'll have everything that is downloaded and everything that is installed. Ideally, you're going to want the second bar to be completely green as that indicates that everything is 100% installed. You can also find this out by going through any of the individual sets and seeing if they have installed in a green font to the far right. Doing this will allow you to install the remainder of your program by just simply clicking download and install files, walk away, and within a short time your band the box will be fully installed.